Top 5 Best Ham Radios Number 5. Anytone Amateur Radio After using this radio for 3 months, I can say that I'm satisfied with how this unit performs in my day-to-day -day ham operations. Particularly, I'm happy with the radio's wide VHF or UHF frequency. Its capability to transmit at 136 MHz to 480 MHz, and to receive 108 MHz up to 490 MHz frequencies make this a reliable mobile radio. Also, the power output of this dual-band transceiver is versatile. This radio can tone it up to 50 watts, 40 watts, and down to a measly 5 watts the advertised power is what you get out of this little device. Additionally, this radio is also easily programmable. It is Chirp compatible, so you can plug it into your personal computer and program from there. It also comes with a free USB cable, that way, you don't need to buy one to program it from a desktop. The mobile ham radio also includes an illuminated keypad, making it easier to navigate and make proper ham adjustments in the dark. Also, the unit has a body speaker, mic speaker, and an optional external speaker that you can install to the radio. This Anytone mobile radio has also 700 memory channels for your frequency storage. Additionally, the radio set also comes with a crossband repeater mode, a simultaneous ham receiver, and a separate control for the radio's volume and squelch settings. Coming in number 4. Yesu FT2980R Mobile Transceiver. As a ham radio enthusiast, I'm quite satisfied with how this radio performs in my day-to-day -day ham operations. This 2-meter mobile radio gets the job done, thanks to its capable transmission power of 80 watts and wideband receiver. While we're at it, the power output of this mobile radio is quite flexible, transmitting at 80 watts, 30 watts, 10 watts, and 5 watts such a diverse selection of power transmission ensures flexibility in your ham operations. This unit also comes with a built-in heatsink. This feature certifies the stability of the radio when using the highest power setting, without the need for fans and other cooling devices. Hence, this radio is ideal for use in a dry and hot region, solving the issue of heat building up. I often find myself using the 80 watt option without worry. Likewise, the audio quality of this radio also meets and exceeds our expectations. Due to the radio's audio power output of 3 watts, I can clearly hear who I'm talking to, even in noisy conditions. The built-in DCS encode or decode in CTCSS is also helpful to my daily ham operations. Additionally, the vast memory channels is a nice offering for a reasonable beginner's ham radio. The build of this Yesu radio is quite good. Unlike other mobile radios, this unit can literally take a beating and still perform its ham capabilities. Pros The power output of this mobile radio is flexible at 5, 10, 30, and 80 watts. Integrated sync certifies the stability of the radio without cooling devices. Offers clear audio in noisy conditions due to the 3-watt audio output. Provides a vast memory of 200 channels, built-in DCS encode or decode and CTCSS. Can take a beating and still perform its ham capabilities. Cons. A little bit big to fit in modern vehicles. Coming in number 3. Kenwood TM281A FM Transceiver. What I love about this radio is the ton of upside it offers. This rig provides features that can compete with, nay, outclass other mobile radios at its price point. The unit comes with wondrous power radio settings and vast memory channels. It also features encoders or decoders and weather alerts. In detail, I find the radio's construction to be built for long-lasting usage. The case features aluminum, a material that you rarely find used in other cheap radios. What else do you expect from the products at Kenwood? I'm also confidently stating that this is the best all-band mobile ham radio, basing on my experience with the mobile ham. From the front-facing speaker's audio quality to its well-documented sophistication, I truly enjoy using this ham radio when I'm on the road. So much more that I'm planning on getting a new one for my truck. With its compactness and lightness, this micro radio is an excellent ham to work with. The mobile ham radio specifications allow me to carry it and transfer seamlessly to my other workplaces. Pros outclasses other mobile radios at its price point. Power radio settings are at 25 and 65 watts. Aluminum construction to be built for long-lasting usage. Front-facing speakers good audio quality. 
compact and lightweight design for seamless transport. Cons. It takes a while to program a PL tone to a frequency. Coming in number 2. BTEC Mini UV 25X2 Mobile Radio. I'm wholeheartedly happy that I chose to buy this mobile ham radio instead of the others available in the market. Now, I say this as an enthusiast of ham radios. I recommend this mobile ham for multiple reasons. Among those are the synchronous dual display mode of the radio and the vast frequency range, it can reach up to 520 MHz. Notably, its high-tech scanning mode allows users to atomize the radio's frequency scanning and identification. Also, its power setting is quite capable, performing at 25 watts and 10 watts, respectively. The features that I've mentioned make this micro radio a great buy. Based on my experience, the radio's not just capable, but it more than excels at what it's supposed to do, communicate effectively in the air. Moreover, I also like that you can fully customize the display of the radio. From the background up to its text colors, the compact radio's monitor is quite phenomenal. This is not common for other mobile radios available in the market. The unit's compactness is also commendable. Vitex Mobile Ham fits like a glove to my car's compartment. I suppose this is the best ham radio for cars, mainly for its small frame, measuring 10 by 6 by 2 inches and 2 pounds it also comes with a fan, unlike other units. Programming the radio is also quite easy. I hadn't encountered any trouble when I was setting up the radio systems. The internet also has a plethora of guides, especially from the manufacturer's instructions. Likewise, I assure you that the product works as advertised. At its price point, I consider this to be a bang for the buck radio model. Other radios around the $100 point typically have some common issues, but not this one. Pro's expanded frequency range of a radio this size. Synchronous dual radio display. Capable of performing at respectable power settings 25 watts and 10 watts. Fully customizable display. Compact design to fit well in the car compartment. Programming the radio is quite easy. Cons distracting bright display. Coming in number 1. Anytone AT778UV Mobile Radio. I recommend this mobile ham radio for its versatility and handiness in performing the duties comparable to top-of-the-line ham radio setups. This radio, as little as it looks, packs a punch. Chiefly, it's multiple integrated radio features that outperform other mobile radios in its price point. Covering 136 and 174 MHz to 400 and 480 MHz, this little fella can indeed perform what it's advertised for. I think it's fair to say that this radio fares excellently compared to its competitors. What I like about this mobile ham radio setup is the interactive display it has. I find the radio's display to be impressive. Much to do because of its informational and colorful screen, which provides the necessary info in operating ham radios. I'm delighted with the amount of detail that can be found in its display. I also found the operation and programming of the radio to be quite easy. I surmise that this is the top-rated mobile ham radio for beginners. The user interface is easy to work with. And like with other radios, once you get the hang of it, operating this radio can be a walk in the park. Another feature that I also like about this radio is its reliability. Also, the ham radio's advertised power is what you truly get. With a tuner setting of UHF and VHF, it's capable of transmitting your message through the air. Moreover, it provides the necessary output, depending on whether you will use a wideband to narrowband. I'm sure that this compact and powerful mobile ham is among the best that you can find in the market. Pro's versatility and handiness, comparable to top-of-the-line ham radio setups. Covers 136 and 174 MHz to 400 and 480 MHz. Fares excellently compared to its competitors. Impressive radio display. The user interface is easy to work with it comes with a tuner setting of UHF and VHF. Ham radio's advertised power ranges from 25 watts to 5 watts. Cons lack of DTMF functions.